this huge refugee crisis is a crisis we've never seen before. The situation in Europe is incredible at this point. 2015 we've seen a million of refugees arriving. One in four refugees is a child. They are fleeing from the horror of wars from their home country. They have sometimes just their clothing on their backs. This is a serious and big problem we have to face now in Europe and I believe football has a kind of responsibility Based on that, we did agree that all Champions League participants and all Europe League participants, that means a total of 80 clubs, will donate one euro for each sold ticket for their first European home match. We are donating one euro from every ticket sold against Fenerbahce. We support 90 minutes for hope. probably the first initiative ever of this kind where a number of clubs all together through our association decide to invest money for a charity humanitarian objective and despite many of them had already made their own individual initiatives. We are in action to help those many people in need. We are donating one euro for each team sold against Wolfsburg. Manchester United supports 90 Minutes for Hope. We are united to help refugees. This has been for us also a test of, uh, I would say, the loyalty and the success of our organisation. We're very proud of it and we're really happy to, to be able to help children, the innocent victims of something which is happening on them and they could not decide upon. So we really hope that this is going to be a little help. With the ECA funds we are able to help in many ways. For example, providing blankets for the children now in this time where the winter has come. So we're doing a winterization and also providing them with hot meals. With the help of the funds by ECA and the European clubs, UNICEF has been able to provide the most urgently needed medical assistance as well as supplementary feeding for the little children and hygienic and baby kits. Furthermore, another thing that we are operating across Europe and which we are able to build upon with the ECA funds is the child-friendly spaces. They can do different recreational activities, drawings, also reading. UNICEF also provides legal assistance and technical help for family tracking and to facilitate family reunifications for children who've lost their parents. I was very excited to hear that ECA has chosen us as a partner. At the same time, I didn't know exactly what to expect from this partnership. But what I have seen is that the unknown, we mastered together very well. And I was very impressed and moved when I saw in Athens at the game how much we could raise, how much you could raise, how much funding you could raise for children in need in Europe. Football and sports is about fair play, is about solidarity. Clubs join forces to support refugee children in these difficult times. You really can be proud of it and we are very grateful. Thank you very much. I want to thank you on behalf of the children the children that you're not only giving 90 minutes of hope, you're giving them hope for a lifetime.